Hey Meepers and welcome back to another Depth of the Dream video and today we are going to be spinning this Star Wars wheel with every single canon Star Wars thing. Yeah, there's movies, shows, and video games. Except for thing. Young Jedi Adventures, but we don't know if that's canon or not. So we Star Wars Visions is not on this list and if you guys keep if you guys keep commenting that Star Wars Vision is canon. Search it up, it's not. It's not canon. Star Wars Visions is not canon. We saw like the first five episodes and it's absolutely it's say it into the mic. It's buns. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say it's trash. Oh, this is my channel. Alright. I get to say what I want. Okay. And I like so, the mute. Alright, so this has a lot of stuff and we're gonna be spinning it. Whatever movie we win or, or, show. or show or video game. Or video game. We We'll be building out a Lego, and you guys will comment down below whose is better. Yeah, so he'll spin it once, and then I'll spin it once, and then... I mean, there's so much stuff here, so we could do parts 25. Yeah, we can do a ton of parts, and as many parts as we want. Because there's so much, and Star Wars is still going. Like, Acolyte's coming, uh, Tales of the Empire is coming, What's that? Uh, Skellington Crew, you know, there's like so much stuff Wait, coming. what's the other thing? Outlaws. Outlaws is coming, the new video game. It might be canon. So, no, I'm pretty sure it is canon. It's canon because it's between Empire Strikes Back and Return of the Jedi. Mando one? Yeah, Mando's this one right there. Okay. Well, All right. Well, who's going first? My All channel. Right. Spin it. Okay, this is... Wait, right, so I don't want Resistance or the Clone Wars movie. Oh, my favorite Star Wars movie. Wow. Let's go, chat. That is kind of crazy Look, that he so, got Return of the Jedi. Okay, you spin. We're going to remove that, too. Yep. Sorry about the noise, but... Where I, I, I... Yeah, this is from Return of the Jedi. <laughs> my turn! These guys. Give me something good. Or bad. Oh! <gasps> Hey, that's hey I wanted good. that. I wanted that. Okay, Jedi Fallen Order. Try to vote him. Okay. Why, what? A Garfield? <laughs> Excuse me? Hey, 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 hey. You saw nothing. You saw nothing. <laughs> okay, so we just made I get Jedi Fallen Order. And I got Return of the Jedi. Return of the Jedi, my favorite Star Wars movie. So I think also, both... it's my favorite Star Wars movie. Actually, it might be my favorite. I also really like Revenge of the Sith. So, yeah. So, as you can see, we have so many more to pick from next time. Once we, like, say what we're voting, we'll pop a picture on screen so you know what we're voting. Yeah, but, yeah. I, I actually really like my choice. So then let's build a scene from the thing. But first, let's go to Junior's room and pick out some mini figs. Let's go. Okay, so guys, since you guys have never seen this, this is all of the Lego Star Wars main pairs I own, and it's back to back. Here, let's open it. Look, it's back to back. So there's two rows, one row right here and one right here. Hey, we don't need to see that. <laughs> Burnt Lizzie dogs, guys. My favorite snack after the video. Uh, so, the scene I'm going to be making is the scene where... Um, uh, Palpatine electrocutes Darth Vader, and we're gonna add Luke here too. So here's all the main figures we need: Palpatine, Darth Vader, and Luke. And I got the good Darth Vader, so I know what your scene is. So you're gonna have the bad one. Okay, so I'm gonna pick Cal. I'll get him. He's Wait, not there's actually no, there's not an official Cal figure. But I made a custom one, so yeah. Look, it's, I can't show it that far, but Junior's taking forever. First off, Here. look at these Bad Batch figures. Why do they care? Here, R.I.P. Tech. tech. These are some mini figures that I, like, already have doubles of and stuff, so who do you want? You want Darth Vader, right? I need Darth Vader because I'm doing the final thing in Jedi Fallen Order where Cal goes against Vader. So here's our Vader. No, here's my Vader. Here's your Vader. Oh, wait, hold on. That one's a bad one. Put that one back. There you go. No, I don't want that one. Well, that one has a torn up cape, so you're going to want that one. And then Cal. Right. He's like Prime Vader. And here's Cal. Yeah, that's the custom Cal. It's not the best, Which but... I will be snagging. Is that all you need? 
Yes. Oh, oh wait, don't we need that girl? What girl? The sister. No, she's dead. Let's go, boom. All right, people. So I added BD1 to Cal because I forgot him upstairs. So now he's got his best bud. I gave Darth Vader here a lightsaber. So that's pretty cool. All right, I'm going to go to a time lapse of uh, me building my scene. And Junior might come up before that about his plan again. Because I'm, I'm doing the final scene where Cal Kestis is literally sprinting. Sprinting across the finish line to get not killed by Vader. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Alright, cool. I'm going to go to a time lapse if you want anything to I say. I actually got to upgrade some of my mini figures, so let's go do that. Alright. Okay, so like I said, I got to upgrade some of my mini figures. So first Luke, he has a bone. That's all we needed to upgrade on him. Then for Palpatine, here he is. We don't really have to upgrade anything, but we're going to change him to his like angry face. Bro. Junior. Yeah. If you guys are watching this, I'm actually setting up uh, a tripod so I could do my time lapse. Yeah, I haven't even started my build. He's going to be starting. But, um, yeah, so if you guys hear like, I haven't even started building. I'm just getting a camera ready. If you guys it. hear like Lego uh, pieces in the background moving and swooshing, that's him. Moving and swooshing. And? You got a problem with that? So now, let's upgrade Darth Vader. And for that, um, he loses his right arm, right? Yeah, we're just gonna remove his right arm. Bro, I'm not a Star Wars fan. So we're gonna remove his right arm. I am a Star Wars fan. Yes, you are. We're gonna remove his right arm. Then we're gonna remove his helmet and his head. And we're gonna give him a skeleton head because it's, he's getting electrocuted. Wait, are you gonna use gray pieces? But yes. Uh, I'm using gray pieces. Okay, well, I won't. I don't need to add much. So we're gonna give him a skeleton head because he's getting electrocuted, and then we're gonna give him this clear piece right here. It might be hard to see because it's clear, but there it is. So we're gonna clip it onto his hand. I don't remember what it's called, so sorry about that. So we're gonna clip it on, and then here we have Palpatine. So yeah, we're gonna put it on his hand like that, and then his other arm will kind of be grabbing onto him, and it looks something like that. I'll adjust it better. But yeah, now we gotta get working on our set, which... Bro, this is kind of trippy. What? You're literally filming a video right now. Yeah. Like, you doing that, and I literally just started the time lapse for my thing. That's crazy. So, look, uh, we're gonna be using two of these pieces. Here, let me get the other one. Yeah, we're gonna be using two of these for the base, so it'll be, like, this big. And then we're gonna add, like, black pieces there, like a little bridge. That'll, it'll look pretty cool, so let's start the time lapse. And before I start my time lapse, I am going to show the scene right now of Cal Kestis running away from Vader. So you guys are seeing it right now on there. So I'm not filming. I'm filming. Normal? Yeah. Nice. So you, you guys are probably seeing the scene right now. So that's exactly what I'm building right this second. So now I'm going to go into the time lapse and do it. up big time look so i was doing it it was turning out great i mean we built the size and stuff here's like the clip this gonna be that sorry about the loud noises in the background but yeah I'm, I'm i'm working hard on my build right now yeah but look i didn't realize i thought it would be something like this but then i don't know why i thought that because i didn't know it'd be this skinny two studs wide so like look so once you add them it's like super skinny so like I don't like that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna extend this two bricks more, and then there will be like one brick like all the way through here, but just like black, and then the rest will be gray. And then it should look something like better than a little better than this basically. But this will have you how wide 
the bridge thing is and then you can easily fit a minifigure on there so yeah we're gonna kind of restart so yeah All right, so a little update real quick. Uh, if you guys think this is a legal building technique, it is not because I used a jumper plate mm -hmm. and I placed it like this so it looks like it's tilting. Good boy. Because the bridge cowl is running on it's like tilted, so I made it like that. I'm doing a box. I put a box here. Vader's going to be at the ends being a complete menace. So yeah, don't call the cops because it's not illegal. Really yeah, yeah. It's the not cops illegal. won't be coming after us. Are you sure about that? I'm not doing anything illegal. Okay. Here. I'm not either. I'm not either. This is technically yeah, illegal. I just broke a brown piece. Bro. Trying to get it off of a thing. I broke it. So yeah, I put this railing here. And I'm hoping to get a little table done right here. So uh, I'm going to time lapse me doing the table right now. So let's do that right now. Table is complete. It doesn't look the best. If you guys don't know, I just restarted my whole build. My thing doesn't look the best right now, the table. So I'm going to fix it real quick. Yeah. In the middle of this video. Chat, his looks better than mine though. I actually had to restart. There we go. Now it's better. What is that? It's a table. Like one of those computer things. What? Yeah. Shouldn't it be facing that one? <clears throat> well, I made if you don't know what I'm talking about, I uh made some adjustments to that table right there. Yeah. It, it's just here now. So the, should it be facing this way? Uh, it's actually supposed to be on this side, but why is it facing that way though? Because I made a pivot, okay? Alright. Really Resume the time lapse. <laughs> New location check, boys. Yeah, I moved spots because that white table was so bendy and it was messing up my build. So I just wanted to let you know that I'm moving to this table. I'm also trying a new technique of using this clear piece right here to look like Darth Vader's forcing like something at uh, Cal Kestis. So roll the time lapse. <laughs> All right, so I'm almost done with my build, but I am going to teach you guys how to uh, put BD-1 on Cal's back. So, like, if you watch the games, he's always on his back BD-1. So, I'm going to teach you guys how to do it. So, first, you get this piece right here that will attach to Cal's back. So, let's do that real quick. By the way, guys, I finished one. Yeah, I'm done, too. I just, I just wanted to teach him how to. And I'm not going to show you guys my build until... Because my build's right here. There's a little sliver. But it's done. I'm going to show you guys when we uh, compare them both. Right, Junior? Yeah. So, we're going to put this clear jumper piece right there. And then we're going to put BD1 right there. And that's how you do it. No, it's bad. <laughs> no, it looks pretty good. He's on his back. So now, I'm going to put him on the build. And you're going to decide 
which build is better. Let's do that. So, since I spinned the wheel first, I will be sharing my build first. Yeah, and we just finished both of our builds. Mm -hmm. And here's the build. I chose the scene... Why'd you stop talking? I chose the scene where Darth Vader is throwing Palpatine off. And here's how it turned out. I think it turned out really good. So, here we have Darth Vader right there with his skeleton head because he's getting electrocuted. We have Luke Skywalker just... Vibing after an incident. I'm not sure. Be vibing. Do that. Hold on. I'm gonna move Darth Vader over one. Then here we have Palpatine up here, all angry with his electricity. And then we have this wasn't in the picture that I was basing off on, but I feel like the bridge was a little boring, so I added some Empire crates. And then here is Palpatine just flinged off. Flingy boys. What does that even mean? So then here we have the railings and stuff. It's four studs wide, so you can fit a ton of space. You can fight on here. You can talk on here, whatever you want with your Lego guys. Then on the side, there's like big old towers that like come up. And since I didn't want to stop, man. Like a horse be like. So yeah, so this is black because it's supposed to be like deep. And then this stuff right here is those like big old towers that come up. So here it is, rate mine in the comments. And yes, uh, I think it turned out really well. So now let's see Dabs. Dabs is way bigger than mine. Yes, I went gigantia. Gigantic. Okay. Okay, buddy. So here is my build. Jedi Fallen order so this one is pretty cool because i really wanted to do the video game because i feel like it's the most interesting and because it's not like this game it has nothing based off the sets except for a giant bd1 build right and that's it yeah so that's why i really want to do this because it has basically no sets this of set the game might actually come in lego soon because cow is coming to LEGO. no i think cow might just be a 25th anniversary what the heck? <laughs> Alright, so, I chose the scene where Darth Vader... That's kind of crazy. We both did Darth Vader scenes. We oh. both have Darth Vader in our scene. We both have Darth Vader being a menace. Yeah, obviously. Okay, stop it, Junior. Oh, so, I uh, showed Darth Vader using the Force with that clear stud right there. Using the Force to use this thing. As you can see, it is floating. So it's like you didn't really a piece need that, going you know? to Cal. You didn't really need that big old one, but it's all good. And then you, Cal is running away from Darth Vader Sorry with about BD-1. That. And I did not use a illegal technique. I showed that. And this scene was terrifying in the game. So I remember playing this scene and I was terrified. I was like, oh, goodness. This is really scary. So side by side. Right, Junior? Yeah. Let's put them side by side. Yours and mine. Yeah, so, comment down below who won. Rate each of ours in the comment and tell us who won. And we will be filming another one, so expect another one to be posted either this week or next week. And I'll see you guys in another video. Goodbye, beepers.